Hello, welcome. I'm Julianne and I'm going to show you how to make your Kintsugi Mended Heart Birds. All right, let's get started. I'm just going to move the video down to my workspace. All right, so you've got your painted bird and the white cardstock, which you will be gluing the bird to. So the first step is to rip it into around four pieces. So I'll just take it and rip right there, right there, and there, and then kind of line the pieces up around the bird the way that they go. All right, next you're gonna take a brush and some glue, and you're gonna put a coating of glue all over the white bird cutout. So just a thin layer, but make sure you get it all the way to the edges in all the sections. And down here on the tail. All right, you can set that down. I usually start with the headpiece and you can take the white part and put your fingers right along the edge of the head so that you can set the top piece on and it will line up correctly. You can kind of use your fingers to get it into place. All right, now set it down. You wanna put some glue on this white part of the paper the under part that was ripped. And then take the next piece, and again, put your fingers around the edge of the white so you can kind of line it up as you go. And it doesn't have to be exact. We are gonna be painting over the rips with gold paint. All right. Now, once again, you're going to take your brush and put some glue on that exposed white paper from the piece that you just put on. And next is the second wing. Again, hold the piece there. Line it up. All right. Some more glue on this edge. And now the last piece. Line the tail up. And it should fit right in there. Whoops. All right. So you're gonna just push down and make sure it's sticking in all the places. Um, if you have time, you can go ahead and lay this under a book to keep it flat while it dries. But if not, that's fine. Just make sure you press on it. And if any of the pieces start lifting up. And then I went ahead and did one ahead of time so that this is all dry now and so we are ready for the next part putting the gold okay so we have our bird it's all dry now and it's time to paint the gold into the cracks and on the edges so i usually start with painting the cracks first and then go around the edges so take your your brush and dip it in the gold paint just a little bit on the tip and then start at the outer edge and just put a little layer of gold. Into this crack. And again, it doesn't have to be perfect. That's part of the beauty of Kintsugi. Repairing the broken parts. Okay, so now I've got all the lines done there. 
And if you want to let it dry just a little bit before you do the edges so you don't smear it, that's probably a good idea, but you can just um, work around it and not touch where you just painted. So next you're going to do the edges. So just a little thin line of paint right around the edge. And take your time on it. And enjoy the process. Enjoy the colors, color of the gold. So once you're finished painting the gold and the cracks and on the edges, the next step is to put a layer of gloss on both the front and the back. So I usually start with the back. Uh, dip your brush in the gloss medium and put a thin layer all along the back. And Go ahead and let that dry before you do the front. Again, you can use a hair dryer to speed up the drying. I'm gonna go ahead and just put it on the front without letting it dry, just to show you. So again, just a thin layer all over. And this will not only protect it and put a nice layer of acrylic on there, it will also give it a nice sheen and it'll bring out the colors. Make it a little brighter. All right, so there you go. So once you're done with that, I've got one that's already dry. It's got the gloss on it and on the back. Um, the next step is to go ahead and to glue the magnet to it. So again, take your brush and you can put it in the glue and you just need a little, little dab of glue. And you're gonna put the magnet, you can see here, just underneath the, where the neck meets the wing. So right about there. And let that dry. And then once that's dry, you can hang it as a magnet or you can use your hook. The hook will attach right to the magnet. You can use that to hang it as an ornament. And there you've got your Kintsugi Mended Bird. All right, thank you, enjoy.